Hey, what's up, everybody? I'm Michael the Ark of Let's Play Gaming Entertainment. We're on the trail of a lesser kudu. And there's something here. I'm not sure what it is. We need to. All right, I need to make sure that I have that. I don't think it's the one that I'm looking for. It very well may be, though. So we have. We have a tag for several of basically every animal here, but. What we're going to do is I'm not sure what this is. I'm scared to just stand up and go, but uh, what we're going to do is try to track him down and see if we can possibly possibly find him. He is about as big as they come. That is a lesser kudu right there. So Ah, uh, that's well, just beautiful. All right, I'm going to go on and sneak up here. We're going to see what else we see here because it's just, it looks like we've had... Oh, there she is. All right, we're going to actually switch over and see if we can spot her again. Tree in the way. Okay. There she is. Now, there's another one right there. That's another female. I have a tag for female as well, but I'm looking for a dusky. Hopefully, I could find one. I can't tell what that one is. That is a male. Um, I need to sort of try to remember where that's at. All right. I simply need to be able to see what this is. The problem is he's going to spook. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay. He was a big one, but not the one I was looking for. <laughs> Let's go up here, see if we can't find our track, and then get back on that trail. We picked up our track, and we are back on the trail. Uh, he seems to have slowed down here as well, so it's very possible that we could be getting close to him. I really hope so, because I'm getting cold out here, even though it's, it's Africa. It can get a little bit cold at night sometimes, so Whew. I just really hope that we can find this guy. All right, we've just come up on another little pile of poop, and I really think that he's he's went on past here quite a while back. I, I don't know. I just think that he's well ahead of us. I'm kind of scared that we're not going to find him tonight. We might have to come back. The next night or like tomorrow night and see if we can't look for him again um i know about where he should be i might could set up a couple of tripods in the area i just don't know if i would actually see him because there's a lion over here as well that keeps sort of spooking everything out as well but we're going to continue to follow the track i i'm going to squat up here, uh, just crouch up in this bush and see if we see anything at all, if we see any other tracks or anything ahead of us. Okay. Looks like there are some more tracks right up there. It goes over a ridge. 
I'm not sure. Unfortunately, I think we may have just passed him. Um, let's go to that poop right there and see. I'm pretty sure that he actually just walked right past us. He actually, no. Um, that probably wasn't him. That poop looks a little bit older as well, so, but he did come back this way, which means we may be able to find him around the lake somewhere now. I don't know. Um, that's a fairly big one, but that's not him. That's the other big one. I really was hoping that he would be with those. Uh, we could just take that guy and have him for our tag, but I'm, after seeing the other one, I kind of really want to go ahead and get this one. I'm going to just check this really quick again. It looks aging, so I'm going to go ahead and crawl a little bit and see if I can't find anything else to go on. Okay, we've spotted him. He's back over there. <sighs> okay, <laughs> so we have our 30 alt 6 with us. He's 233 yards out. Let's see. I don't know if we'll be able to do this with the scope. I don't want to take that chance. I think what we're going to do is we're just going to cut our light off. We're going to try to take a shot on him really far out in the dark. I can see him a lot better this way. Oh, he is down, y'all. He is down. Whew. Okay. That, that was a hunt there. Let's go over here and see if we can't claim our prize. On our way to pick him up, we just got a call from a mail line again. We're going to run on over here anyway. Oh, no. I think that he went the other way. We're going to go ahead and actually uh, pull out our 300 just in case the lion tries to attack us. Whew. Wow. This has been one heck of a hunt, y'all. Okay, we should be in the general vicinity. Um, he's actually... It, He's really close to where the uh, ground blind here is. And, oh, there he is. I see him. The line went on and left us alone, but, okay. And that looks like vital blood to me. This is a really nice, a really, really nice kudu here. All right, let's pick him up and see about how big he actually is. He is a 26.9, and oh wow, we actually shot him double lung and heart. Wow, that is nice. He is, I believe he's about 203 pounds, close to 204, and I'd say he's probably my second or third biggest that I've ever got. Um, so these hunts that we're doing for this series, all of these animals are actually going to be going into a new lodge and I'm going to go on and throw him in there. And at the end of the, the hunt season, we will show off the lodge, I think. Uh, so 
that is all for now. It actually took us four complete episodes to find him, but you're only going to see the one that we got him in. Uh, it's just way too much footage otherwise. So I hope you all have enjoyed, and I will see you in the next hunt.